I've said it multiple times over and over and over and over. Charleston White is a walking contradiction. You talk shit about these gang members, about people who in gangs, but yet you was a gang member. And then you say, oh, I was only a gang member in jail. Well, that means you was a punk and scared for your life, so you had to join a gang, right? Well, make it the worst out of all of it. What make it the worst is you talk all this junk about people beefing, how we beefing over streets and we beefing over neighborhoods that we don't own. Yet you're a 40, probably 50 year old man beefing with Mob James, another 50 year old man. You be on here trying to preach and teach and show the youth the way and do all this and do all that. But then you get in front of these cameras and you just switch it all up. Come on, bro. Why is you 40, 50 years old beefing with Mob James, bro? I thought you were supposed to be showing us the way. I thought you were supposed to be, you know, trying to get the youth out of the gangs, trying to get the youth out of the jails. Again, man, the stuff I've heard about Charleston White that he does behind the scenes, I salute him for. But then when I see him in front of this camera, when I see him talk about, you know, when he in certain situations, it's a whole different story. Yeah, I check the drip out. Satin five, yeah, you know. Anyway, I just don't understand it, man. And I just feel like if you teaching and you preaching and you trying to get kids to stop messing with gangs, you trying to get kids to stay out of jail, you trying to get kids to go to school, and I just don't understand why you can't stick with that. Why you keep getting on these platforms and you basically biting the bait that they giving you, man. Like, they won't. It's just so funny to me. So funny. Even Vlad said it. He was embarrassed for y'all. Yeah, I was embarrassed for you too, man. Because at first, I thought you was really preaching and teaching. I thought you was really trying to get these young boys to get on the right path, but... You just like everybody else, man. Trying to get a way out. Trying to get some money to get a way out. And whatever you can do to make that money, you gonna do it. You know what I'm saying? And I see that's with you, man. Like I say, man, y'all gotta watch that boy, man. The boy's a walking contradiction and I'm gonna keep on saying it. I'm gonna keep on standing on it until I see something different. You don't want getting on all these platforms and running your mouth. So it is what it is, man. All I'm saying is stick to one lane, man. Stick to teaching and preaching. I mean, you too old to be in the streets and stuff like that. So, you know, you might you just need to leave that alone, fam. Shout out to you, though. Shout out to Mark James. Hey, man, let me know what y'all think about them two guys beefing. Think they too old to be beefing? What y'all think? Let me know, man. Let me know. I know y'all gonna let me know.